Hey everyone, what's up? It's me, yeah boy, Maker Kun. And I'm back with another video. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how you can use this 0.96 inch OLED display with an Arduino in order to display your own image on it. Like this. Let's get started, but first, here's the intro. Hit that subscribe button. Before printing the image on OLED display, let's understand some basics about it first. An organic light emitting diode, OLED or organic LED. Also known as an organic L, organic electroluminescent, diode, is a light emitting diode, LED, in which the emissive electroluminescent layer is a film of organic compound that emits light in response to an electric current. This organic layer is situated between two electrodes, Typically, at least one of these electrodes is transparent. Anyways, let's get started. First you need to install these two library from the library manager. Search SSD and install this SSD 1306 library by Adafruit. Install it and then search GFX, install the GFX library by Adafruit and you're halfway done. Now let's wire everything together. Connect A4 to SDA pin and A5 to SCK pin. VCC to 5 volts and ground to ground. Now plug in your setup with your computer and open Arduino IDE. Open Adafruit SSD 1306 in example and select this sketch. Upload this sketch to your Arduino. If your OLED doesn't work, then try to change this address to 0x3c. It's 0x3d by default. After uploading, your OLED should display. twenty eight x sixty four bit map image on our OLED display. First you need to change the resolution of your image to one hundred and twenty eight by sixty four pixels. Use an imaging program to resize a photo or picture and save it as monochrome bitmap. If you're on a Windows PC, you can use paint. Now download the LCD image converter which basically converts your bitmap image into a C array. We gonna put this array into our sketch. Open the image in the LCD image converter and set these settings in option. Change the block size to 8 bit and then hit convert option which will export a .c file which contains our required array. Open this .c file in notepad and copy this array and paste this into the sketch. All sketches which I've been using can be downloaded from this project's Hackster page. Now upload this sketch to your Arduino board and bang.
And that's all for today guys. If this video was helpful then leave a like and hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.